resawing uh, soft maple for the drawer bottoms. gluing up the um, other bottom panels so I've got one made but uh, got three more bottom panels here so uh, we've got the calls on them and uh, they're uh, glued so they should be ready for tomorrow cutting out the bottoms uh, to match the curve on the drawer fronts a uh, bevel now on the bottom of the drawer bottoms on three sides with the uh, router. I've got the uh, first of the drawer panels bottoms uh, made here um, so you can see as I, I cut out the curve in the front to match the slot along the the front and then I beveled the edges as you saw with the uh, the router bit and it's down to under a quarter inch on the edge <clears throat> but as it fits into the slot it gets larger of course so it it fits in uh, slipped it in from the back and it fit in quite well so I've got three more to make. I'm putting uh, quarter inch grooves into the uh, bottom uh, edge of the uh, drawer sides here with uh, my plow plane and uh, there are more efficient methods of doing this but it uh, gives me the satisfaction of having it done by and and it's not very noisy. Well, it doesn't take too long. I'm thinking a, a lighter bite at the moment because this uh, maple is kind of curly and it and it tears off. <laughs> So I've got the stop set at a, a quarter inch so it'll stop cutting. So it won't take too long to get through. I've got eight sides to do.
putting the groove on the glove from the bottom. See if the uh, the bottom fits in here like so. There you have it. That's a pretty good fit. You normally leave them a little bit proud in the in the back, but. Uh, Follows the contour fine, and so a couple more to go.